welcome back to another vlog. Today we are going longboarding and we'll see what we get up to because I have no idea, no plans, no intentions. We're just gonna glow with it and I wanna bring y'all along with me. So let's go, woo! Can we just appreciate this view? Woo! Hi. what? Um, yes please. And this? <laughs> I don't like walking through it because I feel like my ankle can go through it and that just bad news. Mm -mm. Uh oh, this is a bad idea. Other way. <laughs> so right now the way that we're cruising is to this little campground that we had a fire at last night. Oh, that was a scary wobble. Oh. Okay, maybe I shouldn't vlog and longboard at the same time. But we had a nice fire last night because the fire ban is finally off because it's been on all summer because it's been extremely dry here. So many forest fires happening in BC, so I totally understand it. But last night we came here and it was super fun, but we cruised here in the dark. So we're gonna cruise here in the daylight and see what it looks like. So let's go. Woo blue day. There's clouds in the sky, but it's like a perfect balance. Mm. Check these mountains, man. Ooh. Ooh. The camera doesn't even do justice, honestly, but it's great. So we changed our mind. Well, I changed our mind because my boat was hurting. So now we're going on a bike ride through this really pretty trail right across the street from me. There's a beautiful river beside it. So I'll show you some clips so you can enjoy it just as much as I am. And it got really hot, so jacket came off, tank top is on. Even though it's fall, we're still breaking a sweat. Oh. Check it out. Beauty, beauty everywhere I go. Right there. Oh, can you see them? Oh, no, it's too late. There will be more chances. My little ears are really chilly though. Ugh. 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 Side note, this is a really sick hat that I got for free. It says, I don't know if you can see it. Bamf, can you club? Am I part of the Bamf Canoe Club or did I just find this hat? I don't know. Boom, mountains again. Oh yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, so beautiful. God's creation. Ugh. There are no words. The river just goes and goes and goes. And you can run around it and bike around it and sing songs and play guitar around it. There's so many activities you can do by the river. It's endless, really. And a lot of people kayak down here too. Oh, bump in the road. Oh, another bump. Oh! <laughs> And if you guys saw my last video where I was playing music with friends, that was right there. Woohoo! Over here in Lake Louise, it seems that one minute it can be super hot and you just want to be in a tank top and like a nice pair of pants, and then all of a sudden you're like, <laughs> and you need a toque and a jacket, and you know, it's just the way it goes. I've never been somewhere where it shifts so quickly, but you adapt, so. Look how beautiful this river is. There's so many rocks and trees and things and meh. <sighs> oh, wow. I'm so happy to have my camera back. This quality is so good, so I can share with you guys what it's like living where I'm living. Because it's so epically beautiful, and you know that a camera can only do so much, but at least, at least I have a good camera. Woohoo! So we've abandoned the river. We're doing this huge loop around it, and honestly, I've never been this far. I've never been this far. So this is an adventure for all of us. So we'll see where it takes us. I love this forest. It's so magical and mystical. If you love trees and you love mountains, you love water and lakes and streams and all that kind of jazz, I definitely recommend that you come out here because this is just epically beautiful. And I'm stoked to see what it looks like in the winter time because it's gonna be Narnia. And I've never seen it before, so. That'll be so cool. I can't wait to have a GoPro and bring you guys along when I go to the ski hill. Woo! It's gonna be so much fun! Oh, hello. Oh, it's gone. Oh, look at that little head. Wow, wow, wow. Where did his body go? It's like those things where they try to pretend to walk downstairs. <laughs> Francine, where'd you go? You took the cookies. Ah! One of my favorite things to do is to come down here and sit by the river. Ooh. Mm. Ooh. 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 <laughs> if only your arm could bend all the way around. 
and happy I was smart and brought some hot water because my throat's feeling a little scratchy. I like this sick water bottle that I traded bands over here. It's sick, these stickers are awesome and there's also a couple Hawaii ones which is really cool, that's what caught my eye. Like over here we've got, hold on, let me put my top on so I don't spill all this water. The Hawaii National Volcano Park, I probably said that backwards, but you know what I mean. So this is the water bottle that I traded and I just noticed this and I didn't even notice before but I'm thankful I did trade this water bottle because check this out. No, honey. No. Not. Not for me. And over here we've got Kona Cope, which is from Honolulu. Oh my god, I've been getting so many Hawaii signs lately and I don't know what to take from it. Actually, this morning, okay. So, check this out. I'm gonna go on a little bit of a express of my thoughts thing here. So, basically, for the last several years, every time before I go to Hawaii, I start to see a bunch of little signs and they just happen repetitively. And I'm just like, okay, I need to go back to the island but I'm getting all these signs and I don't have any intention of going back. So what I'm taking from this is that when I was in Hawaii, I was vibing so high, like so high. <laughs> and I want to stay on that vibration. So I feel like, I don't know if I'm going back this winter. I really do not know. I have no intention of going, but I'm open to it. So for right now, what I'm gonna take from it is just doing the things that I know I need to do to serve my highest good and keep living my truth and keep progressing and to not stay stagnant. That's what I need to take from this because when I look back on my videos, yes, I do watch my old videos because I love reminiscing and I love the memories I have in Hawaii. So that's what I'm taking because when I watch those videos, I see me just like shining and glowing and I don't want to lose that and lose my spark. So I'm going to take that happiness and bring it absolutely everywhere because I remember saying, you know what, I'm gonna miss this island so much, but I am so happy and so full of love and all I wanna do is just help others become a happier version of themselves. So I'm going to just keep that, stay in that little aura of loveliness and just cruise with it. So that's that's just a little tidbit I wanted to share with y'all. Also, yes, I did get my nose pierced. What's up? Ooh, I've been wanting to do it since I got here because I saw all these girls having nose piercings. So I'm like, they look so cute. So I did it. I put it off for so long because I was so scared of the pain, but honestly, it didn't even feel like anything. It felt like, it didn't, it didn't even hurt. It didn't even feel like a needle went through my nose. I was like, are you actually done? He's like, yeah. I'm like, whoa, trippy. <laughs> so yeah, your girl's got some bling. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> when your homies put on your favorite song. Oh, oh. oh this is so good. Hopefully my camera doesn't fall. That would suck. I know, right? <laughs> Put, put, oh, you can't put down there. two currents are like colliding and then just creating one and coming down the stream and it's so sick because there's so many calm parts and then it's just like water is so amazing I've actually drank out of this river like several times and honestly it was the most refreshing water I've ever drank in my whole life and I don't know maybe it's not good for me I'm actually not too sure but I did it and I'm still here so are coming get up <laughs> oh, yeah, after this I'm gonna hit the sauna it's gonna be perfect and eat Ooh. perks of the job is being able to go in the sauna in the hot tub whenever you want so I'm taking full advantage while I work here because I mean how could you not it's a free hot tub and a free sauna like also, just want to like voice this just because I didn't know. So, if any of you ladies are watching and you want to go topless, because I like going topless everywhere, it's my legal right in public places. I didn't know that like, maybe this is obvious, but I didn't know that workplaces are private. So, when you try to go topless in the hot tub in the sauna, maybe don't do it or like ask your manager first because at least where I work, that it ain't, it's not allowed. So, just a little FYI. <laughs> 
honestly love my hair when it gets all crazy like this. Ah, so we've been laying here for a hot minute. We're gonna get cruising and get blood flowing because it's getting a little chilly by the lake. But the irony is it's getting chilly, but I wanna go get a slushy. How does that work? <laughs> But like I think about it like this, you know, you go home, you get a nice cozy sweater, you're nice and warm, and then you go get a cold slushy. So it balances out, right? Right. <laughs> Look how cute this is. Caution. I wonder what this is <laughs> pertaining to. <laughs> yeah, this is a house bike, so a lot of drunk riders definitely take this. I think was this the one Rob flew off the handles from? Yeah. Yeah, and he ended up in the hospital, so you know. Don't drink and ride, kids. <laughs> Let's go this way, man. All right, so we're gonna finish the loop. Whoop, whoop. Bye, baby. I love this trail. It's so awesome. It's so great to run to, except I haven't done that. <laughs> I've done half of it, but I haven't done the whole thing. But it's really nice to ride your bike through. It's so quiet, relaxing, peaceful. Hello. Baby on board. Honestly, one thing I have mad props for is when I go hiking and I'm hiking up steep mountains and I see parents who have a baby on their back and I'm just like, woo, that baby is going on adventures and it doesn't even know it. <laughs> Honestly, what a hell of a workout that would be. I don't know how down I'd be. I feel like your legs would just be like jacked after one time. Okay, I'm gonna go because I don't want to drop my camera. So I'll see you soon. Woo. So check this out. I'm gonna zoom up here. What you're about to see, all those little lines right there, that's the ski hill. So in a little bit, you're gonna see a girl shredding down those with a GoPro on her head looking like a fool, but you know, it's gonna be worth it, so. <laughs> Ta-da! I know that was a very short, not very meaningful video, but I mean, it was a little snippet into my day and kind of what I do when I just go cruising around. And yeah, that was fun to bring you guys along with me, switching up between the longboard and the bike. Very good for both the things that we did. Longboarding along the campground, and I honestly didn't even go that far because we hit this one road that was super gravelly and I was just like, mm, I don't want to do this. Because my ankles are still kind of like, like a little bit tweaked. If I, if I move them wrong, honestly, I'm gonna sprain them again and I really don't wanna do that. Especially before the season starts, I would not wanna be injured before snowboarding season starts. That would like suck. But other than that, those are kind of two of my like favorite things to do. So you came along with me for that. And I know it wasn't like a super epic adventure or anything drastic, but I mean, welcome to a day in my life. Do, 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 do. So um, I'm honestly just gonna chill out for the rest of the day because it is pretty cold here. Uh, I don't really have any motivation to go outside right now. Probably gonna hit the hot tub and the sauna a little bit later. For right now, I'm just making some tea and me and a friend are gonna watch a movie and just chill out. It is my day off today. Saturdays and Sundays are currently my days off, which is really nice. And the days here fly by. Like honestly, I'm like, wasn't I just on my day off like hiking mountains like yesterday? No, it was a week ago. Time flies when you're having fun. But don't <laughs> so I've got a little, 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 okay, what is English? Let's try again. Um, so yeah, my day is going to be pretty chillax, so I'm not really going to vlog for any of that because it would be pretty boring, but uh, yeah, I'm going to go do that and you do you and give a thumbs up if you like this video and you want more clippets of kind of like what I like to do on my days off other than just hiking mountains. If you want me to start vlogging more, definitely let me know. I'm open to that. I don't feel like I'm one of those people who like vlogs every day because honestly my day isn't exciting enough <laughs> to be vlogging every day. Um, but I'm going to be using my camera as much as I can for sure. So if you want more of that content, let your girl know and uh, she'll take it into consideration. I know this is not the most aesthetically pleasing background, but it'll do. So I'm going to go have my tea and watch a movie and oh, relax, maybe paint later. We'll see what I get up to. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for joining me and thanks for coming for a cruise. Honestly, longboarding has become such an amazing, enjoying, what do I say, hobby or thing in my life? I don't know, all I know is I love it. Being on a skateboard, well, okay, I'm not on a skateboard. Being on a longboard is the most freeing thing. It's amazing. The only thing I'm finding I'm having a little bit of issues with is my shoes. I don't know if I need better quality shoes. I'm just wearing these little Eco Sneaks that I got from the thrift shop in Banff for like nine bucks. They're awesome. They're actually called Eco Sneaks like right here. And they're made out of recycled plastic and tires and cotton and stuff like that. And apparently they're discontinued. I put them up on Instagram and um, yeah, people were like, oh, those are so cool. I want to see if I can get some. And then they were like totally discontinued. So that sucks but I'm really stoked that I have these because they're like my favorite shoes ever. It's just that like I can feel it right here 
you know, when I'm like constantly kicking with this foot and then this other one, I don't know, it just feels funky. So yeah, I'm gonna take care of that, do some yoga later, stretch in the hot tub, maybe we'll get a slushie, we'll see, I don't know. Um, yeah, so this is dragging on, okay. Peace out guys, Jazz checking out, I'll catch you in the next one. Mwah!